Rosipoo. Okay. Thank you for following. Hope you enjoy the stream. The tip you just... Oh, of, um... Of trying the diving trick. Yeah. I'm surprised you haven't found any bees. Me too. I think the majority of the trees I've chopped down have been... Um... Oh, someone pinged me. Did someone ping me? No, someone changed. Where are you? It wasn't Rudy. Hey, Z Z I'm gonna say that name wrong again. Thank you for the follow, Zhaoji. Zhaoji? Oh, you're you're happy. What? What are you wearing, Shep? What is that? <laughs> it looks like he's got some type of corset on. What? <laughs> I'm not judging. A Pashmina shirt? Oh my god! <laughs> it's the corseted shirt. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's great. I love it. I heard someone change and he's just so happy with- Oops. Well, rip that purple. Uh, purple tulip. <laughs> still grindy. Uh, Pocket Camp has a lot of updates since then. It's still grindy, but a fun time waster. Okay. Um. <laughs> what a fashionista. Yeah. That's great. I love it. Okie dokie. So that is- Oh, more apples. Okay. Um, let's try and organize this a little bit. So I'm gonna have a row at the bottom of all the fruit. Like so. There we go. And if I can get, like, two stacks of each fruit, then that would be great. I know it- oh. Hang on, this is gonna be a B, isn't it? No? Okay. I know I said three of each one, but honestly, like, two of each one is gonna be more than enough. That's 18 trees per fruit. Uh, is your town tuned that Mario theme? Yes, the underwater theme from Mario. Hey, Cupcake Nintendo Princess, I'm tearing my town apart. How are you doing? It's usually pronounced Zaoshi. Also, where did that town thing come from? I recognize it from somewhere. I believe I just explained it. Money, that's going nowhere. Yeah, it's, um, oh, is it? It's not, it's the underwater theme for Super Mario 64. Uh, so Jolly Roger Bay and the other one that I can never remember. Yeah, the Happy Home Designer like challenged Pocket Camp. Oh, they did? Oh, okay. That brought up some nostalgic memories, yeah. There's the bee beehive. Uh, so... Nope, missed it. Don't look at me. I'm hideous. About time though, right? Die, die, docks. That's the one. Yep. Oopsie poopsie. Finally got stung. Stunning! Ha! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> you you under Badumtus. All right, keep on going. Well, chopping down all of these cedar trees actually is is really hurting me. Also, Cosmo the Magician, thank you for the follow. Hope you're having a great Thursday. I can't believe it. Good job. You got the pun in. Wasn't even intended, it doesn't matter, that's the best type. Unintentional puns. Why do so few boys play Animal Crossing? I don't know. They're too busy playing Fortnite. <laughs> Next time you better be ready! I tried. I even have um, a bee catching guide that... Uh, oh, I forget what the name of the channel is, but they ripped it off. Like, literally, they just re-uploaded the footage of me doing it. Um, which, uh, annoyed me. We actually got more fruit than I need. Okay. Real men play Animal Crossing New Leaf. Real men. We don't need no Fortnite. Actually, the majority of these fruit will actually fall, won't they? They'll bounce down onto the path. Oh, that one went flying. Okay. Oof, Tazza. I'm assuming that's towards my, um, men are too busy playing Fortnite. I have a Chinese site that uploads my old voice acting videos. Wow, that's weird. Huh. More money, and we didn't get it. That's a shame. Hey, Cooper Bros Fanatic 166. Thank you for the follow. Still annoyed at the fact that there's no Pokemon items in Animal Crossing. Huh. 
never noticed that, to be honest. It's like, can you not steal my content? Yeah, yeah. Like, if they would have even, like, um, referenced me or or linked to my channel or anything, I'd been fine with it because, no, they just re-uploaded it without asking and I'm just like, dude, that's, that's my content. No worries, Sophie. Thank you for coming along. Hope you have a good night. It's almost 9 o'clock, just realized, which is fine. All right, more light cheese. Let's get them. I think Pocket Camp did a Pokemon crossover. True. Yeah, actually. Pokemon isn't Nintendo. No, it's Game Freak. So they'd probably... I don't see why there would be licensing issues to do a crossover in, in New Leaf, but... It's only Nintendo's third biggest franchise is Mario and Zelda. The only one's beating it. True. But then Game Freak is a second-party publisher. Um, so maybe they, there was some legal issues. I don't know. Like I said, I don't see why there would be, but... I don't know law. Okay. This is a. Uh, this is actually starting to become somewhat a little bit painful. Looking at all these. Where is Animal Crossing? Like eighth biggest? Um, I don't know. Actually, if you think, of, if you stop and think about it, there. Ooh, there aren't actually a lot of um, first-party titles. Um, light cheese. Oop, go there. Okay, cool. Cherries, more cherries. Nintendo got the right to use Sonic, Solid State, Mega Man, etc. for Smash. The Pokemon items in the season. That's a good point. And there's also Pokemon stuff in Smash too. I mean, there's loads of Pokemon stuff in Smash. I didn't think about that. Um. <laughs> where did these go? <laughs> Let's just put them there for now. Okay, perfect apples. We haven't got any perfect apples yet. So let's grab a couple of these. Sonic, Mega Man, etc. don't appear in Animal Crossing either. Very true. I mean, maybe they just wanted it to be its own sort of universe. I mean, I know there's Mario and um, Zelda in here, but maybe they just kind of wanted to keep Animal Crossing separate. Who knows? Perfect apples. Lovely jubbly. Uh, we're really running out of space for these now, aren't we? Persimmons. Oh my goodness. Pikachu and Jigglypuff have been in Smash since they debuted on the Nintendo 64. Very true. I don't know why Smash has no issues where Animal Crossing does. Like I said, it could have just been a design choice. They might have, like, if they wanted to add it, they might have had the, the option to, but maybe they just decided they didn't want to. I mean, heck, there's even um, Monster Hunter stuff in, in New Leaf. What item, what Pokemon items would you like to see in uh, Animal Crossing, though? Um, I think the, the PC would be pretty cool. Uh, do they have non-Nintendo characters? I don't think they've got non-Nintendo characters. Um, like, I think they all belong to Nintendo still, but... There are definitely some non-Mario Universe ones. Oh, Pokemon plushies. Yeah, kind of like secret bases. Pocket Camp did a Pokemon crossover where... Let's... Oh, I oh, see. I wasn't playing Pocket Camp back then, so... I do not know. Did not know. Okay, so with the bamboo... I'm going to I'm gonna let them sprout some shoots, and then I'm going to dig them up tomorrow. So that's the other thing as well. Um... Does the color change lighting behind bother you? No, because <laughs> I've got I've got a light up there that's lighting up my face, which is what I most, mostly see, and then I've got this. Um, I did want the light to go a little bit slower, but if I if I switch it to slow, it strobes, and I feel like that's a lot more dis distracting than just eh, having it change quickly. I just thought it's a, an interesting thing to have. If people notice it, they notice it. From what I, <laughs> hey Sean, from what I from what I heard from other people is they didn't find it distracting. It sort of added a, an element of coolness. Nintendo made this happen. So what what ideas have we got so far? Pokeball clock, yeah. A secret hideout PWP. Oh wow, yeah. Kind of like the uh, the bushes from uh, Oras. That would be pretty neat. Maybe there'll be more Pokemon items in ACs for Switch. We never know. Could happen. It could happen. Can't wait to jailbreak my Switch. Alright, for now, I'm going to throw some food on the floor that I, I've got, like, full stacks of. 
Um, just these ones. Yeah. Oh, and oranges. Hello, person that I cannot pronounce. <laughs> Briella Quiqui, I think. Let me know if I said that wrong. How's it going? Hope you're having a good point, uh, Thursday. I keep thinking it's Wednesday. Or we'll use Pokemon as furniture designs. Bellsprout lamp. That could be interesting, yeah. No, you got some good ideas, but I, honestly, the possibilities are endless for like a Pokemon crossover and Switch. Cute idea, but I wouldn't use it. <laughs> wow, burn. All right, let's uh, rip all these out. This lighthouse, I think I'm probably gonna end up moving to somewhere else along the cliff. I do have actually a nice area here which juts out. This could be a cool little place. Or maybe over, hmm, maybe over here-ish. Sort of like sticks out a bit here. And it's right by Coral Cove as well. Coral Cove is down there. That could be brilliant. That's a long message. I'll be careful with that because honestly, if you homebrew your Switch, you have to be on, always on an airplane mode. Otherwise they could collect your data and ban you. They'd be watching. Or if you've got a second Switch, you know, do it on that. But how many people have two Switches? <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't use the furniture and damn you right, yeah. Running through all the flowers. One thing that needs to happen in AC Switch. Alphabetize the catalog. Yeah. I don't know. Or at least have it so that you can order it by either series or alphabet. Do you play with viewers? Uh, this is my first time streaming New Leaf. So I haven't decided yet. The main focus is me redoing my town. I think if I play with viewers, that would kind of distract from that. So probably not. But I'm not ruling it out. Oopsie. I'll just stick with my 3DS because Nintendo doesn't watch your 3DS. I thought they did. Like, haven't they bricked a load of 3DSs? Maybe they're just not as hardcore about it, I guess. I don't know. Brianna Quiqui, thank you for the follow. Oof, so much chopping. Alright. Get rid of all of these as well. Actually, it's so much easier to uh, to just dig up the stumps afterwards. Especially in a big line like this, actually. I think I'm going to do that. Random error made me have to refresh. Blame random. Okay, get rid of that plant. And actually, the rest we can chop down. You aren't frequent about it unless someone reports you. Oh, okay. Interesting. Can anyone help me think of a dot pun for Dottie's greeting? Hmm. For her greeting. What animal is Dottie again? I forget. We are all time. My jailbreaking D's hasn't been affected by Nintendo in any way other than updates which are patched homebrew. Fair enough. Dip in dots. Dot on you later. Dottie is a rabbit. Hmm. A rabbit called Dottie. So I'm just trying to figure out because most of the time most of the time when they come up with the names of their villager, it's usually a pun based on the villager themselves. So I'm trying to sort of see where that comes from. Dot of the morning to you. I don't think that would fit, but that's a good one. Especially if she was Irish. Hop on the dot. On the dot. On the dot's pretty good. Okay. Uh, lots of perfect apples there. Oh, yep, there we go. Full stack of nine. Fantastic. Uh, so we got mangoes and lychees. Oh, so many fruit. <laughs> I don't know what the character limit is. Yeah. St. Patrick's Day was just a little bit... That's very true. It was on Sunday. Sean, did you celebrate? Didn't you have Monday off, Sean? If you're still here. We don't have days off for St. George's Day. You did! Jealous. Sorry, Easter is coming up. Hasn't been able to hack since Welcome Amigo access to Homebrew. Uh, what the <laughs> I'm playing at Nintendo. Well, you can kind of. Oh, I didn't mean to do that to the red carnations. Never mind. Uh, you can kind of um, you can kind of understand why they're trying to get rid of hacking because, like, the majority of people don't hack to do um, save file edits. They hack to get free games. So, yeah. How long have you been playing New Leaf? As in today or in total? Because uh, in total, I played this game for about two years non-stop when it first came out. And now I'm playing it again to fix up my town. 
Um, as in today, I've been playing it for two hours and eight minutes. Because uh, everything thinks it's the best day to drink. So Patrick's Day is actually the worst day to drink because everyone thinks it's the best day to drink, so it becomes the worst day. All right, I understand. Uh, in total, uh, I actually couldn't give you a count of how long I've played because um, I did a system transfer and all my uh, time played went to a different console. So, unfortunately, I do not have that number for you. Are those the same? No, those are mangoes. No, those are normal apples. Those are perfect apples. Cool. Same error struck again. Twitch does not want me to watch it today. Oh, that's a shame. I don't know what to suggest, I'm afraid. Uh, on the 3DS hacking website, there's a tutorial on how to hack slash update. Hack your 3DS with the latest update. There we go. Personally, I wouldn't hack just because I don't feel comfortable doing it, but to each their own, you can do whatever you want with the stuff you buy. I kind of want to keep this orange tree stump here because that's the first special stump I got, and I think I got that with just a regular axe. When I used to live in New Jersey, I went to the boardwalk on the beach. The sign's advertising a party for hallway to St. Patrick's Day. Okay. You know what, that's enough. There we go. Durians. By the way, Sean, if you're still here, Katie uh, has something to put into our group chat. Uh, but she says she's not going to do it until I finish streaming, so you'll have to wait, I'm afraid. She's also banned me from typing anything about it. So, I, I'll probably get in trouble even if I told you. I like surprises. You destroying everything is triggering me. Perfect. I like triggering people. It's fun. Alright, I have no idea how much fruit we're up to now. How long more are you streaming for? Um, actually probably not long thinking about it. I've been streaming for over two hours now, I'm getting kind of tired. Um, so we'll probably be finishing up soonish, I guess. Plus I've got to think of more of a solid battle plan for this. Uh, oh, there's the mangoes. Um, because at the minute I'm just sort of running through everything haphazardly and not focusing on what I'm doing. Well, I have something good to end this. Oh, you have something good to end the stream on? Okay, tell me. <laughs> you just triggered your Alexa. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm honestly, I'm trying to think of something to get it to, to do, but I can't for the life of me think. <laughs> 